not real sure how I want to have this angle for you guys. I think that's the best I can do. I'm trying to get all the boxes in, in one shot. Uh, as you can see, we got crazy amounts of boxes. First thing I want to talk about, though, real quick, is these two figures right here. This uh, Kevin Owens, don't know really who it is from, and this uh, Big Boss Man from 47 Point B, I believe. I don't remember it because of the Point B, uh, but it might be Point A. I don't really, it is A, 47A. Oh, right here, 53. Okay, cool. So that's where those figures are from. Uh, these two figures I got before Thanksgiving, like on a pre-Black Friday sale from Amazon, and uh, they've been sitting in a box for so long. I recorded a video, unboxing video, quite recently, and there's something wrong with the audio, so I was going to put it on here, but I couldn't find the box to put it back in. Kind of a scumbag move, but, you know, I was going to do it. Um, but, yeah, here they were. I thought I would show them to you guys. They're probably what's going to get reviewed first. Um, just slam those down. And then, uh, so this this is the unboxing. We have five... I can't write. Yeah, five packages to get through. This big long boy on the bottom. Two Amazon packages up here, and then these two ringside packages. Uh, that's that's what we're gonna be getting into. Uh, I I know what should be coming figure wise. I should have one NXT barricade playset, which is gonna be in there, uh, and then I should have the brand new Usos Elite set, and then the brand new uh, A Commanders R set. But I have way more boxes than I have figures ordered, so I don't really know what's gonna be coming in these. Um, according to my mom, everything that came is supposed to be me. She's not missing any packages. So everything in here should be, should be mine. Um, and I don't really know what I ordered. There's a lot more than what I can remember ordering. But with that said, let's, uh, get right into it. Let's kick things off first with this ringside collectibles package. Um, so yeah, this ringside, uh, this one was already opened previously once to uh, confirm that it was what it was supposed to be. My bad. Uh, so yeah, I do know that this one is going to be the Usos. We do have Jimmy Uso. My first figures to come with the True FX technology. Um, super excited. One reason I've kind of been staying away from starting a Fed. One, because the amount of work it uh, takes. So I'll probably, I might start one in the summer when I don't really have school. Um... And also, my tag team division was kind of lacking. I didn't want to create tag teams. Uh, but, I mean, I might. I have some tag teams in mind that I might create. But uh, definitely, the Usos are going to help with that. But, guys, I, I have had all these boxes. They've kind of been accumulating for a couple weeks. Here we have Jey Uso. Love this. One thing I'm going to complain about already, I'll have someone do a review. But the, uh, the handcuff already on his forearm, I think that's going to come out super stretched. And I don't want that. There's our first box done and dusted. Sorry about the slam. But one thing that uh, I did duct tape that one as well because it was like starting to crack open from the uh, from the the oh man. Um, but yeah, guys. One thing about these boxes was they've accumulated from a couple weeks. Some of them got here first thing this year. Other ones came just today, like that NXT. And I had them all set up under my shelf, and I was like thinking, hey, I should film an unboxing since I have some free time and energy tonight. And I was like, I have way too many. I don't want to clutter the channel full of unboxings and then wait to review whatever's in the box to uh, do the next unboxing so I don't overwhelm myself. And I just thought that's going to be way too much work, and I'm not down for that. So I thought, you know what, screw it. Why don't we just do a bit of a live unboxing? Um, let me know down in the comment section or right now in the live chat if you guys want me to uh, unbox, all, or not unbox, but review all these figures at once, that seems like it's going to be a heartache and a half. But uh, I, I definitely be down to do it if you guys would be down to watch it. But if not, of course, I'll just do my own thing with the review and add my little special spin to it. Um, so, yeah, let's move on to this ringside package. Do it, uh, let's do the ringside packages first for you guys in case that's all you're here for. Um, yeah, so let's cut this this ringside uh, box open. Obviously, we know what this one's going to be from the uh, the name on the outside there where it said NXT Barricade. Playset, super excited for that. Um, I got this because of, well, I was actually watching New Japan. I was like, you know what? It'd be really cool to have like a metal barricade set like what ringside has. And I'm going to set mine up similar, 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 similarly to how New Japan has theirs set up. Um, 
But yeah, so, and then right as I was thinking, uh, you know what, I might be interested in getting these, G Natty uh, actually posted on his Instagram a picture of him getting his and uh, showing how he used it without the NXT flappages on there. And I was like, you know what, I really like that. And uh, flappages, that might be uh, my damn toys word, but I'm definitely, I definitely just said it. So he might be where I got it from. That box is empty. That boy was packed tight in there. Um, but yeah, so I'm just going to use it, uh, just as the, uh, the metal bracket pieces right here. Uh, much like how he did. Go check out his, I guess. I'd better, sh uh, like, tell you to go watch his since I said it. But yeah, so, definitely super excited for that. I've been binge-watching a lot of New Japan lately. Uh, just a little fun fact for you guys, I guess. Can't wait to review this. This will probably be the first, no, I shouldn't review this first. Because I'm just going to have a bunch of, uh, figure reviews. So I should probably spread those out a little bit. But, yeah, so next we have our first Amazon box. If you guys were just here for the ringside boxing, which I don't know why you would be. But if you were, hey, how you doing? Thank you for stopping by. We're done with you. Ooh, 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 look at that. Can you guys tell who that is? That's already one of the AOP boys. Um, jeez. Uh, let me drop, let me drop the knife real quick. My bad. Oh, sorry, I'm to cut at the bottom. We'll solve that. But anyway, guys. So one figure per box. I guess that's why we have so many. Thanks, Amazon. Here we have Razor. Honestly, couldn't tell him apart without the uh the logo. I guess Akum does have like a Samoan tat, but I don't really know him that well. Empty box, except for the bubble wrap. Pretty cool. Akum comes with the new NXT Tag Team Championships. Crazy thing, I just got the old NXT Tag Champs. Now I'm getting the new ones. Super cool. Um... Honestly, one of my favorite belts. I love, like, the ECW type of belts with, like, the weird cool shapes on the inside of them and the uh, steel pattern. Uh, but, yeah, we'll talk about this figure more as we get the review. Check out that mask. This figure is so cool. The AOP is just so cool. Such a cool gimmick. Um, think that they should still have uh, Paul Elring as their manager. That was really cool. Um, so, yeah, I don't know why I'm saying um so much. I'm going on and on and on. Let's cut open this next Amazon unboxing. I probably could have made a video out of just all these unboxings, but I thought, you know what, why don't we do a bit of a live stream for you guys here. Um, just because of how many we've had to do. Uh, I didn't want to get bored in the video. Then have to give it a bunch of edits. So yeah, here we have... Uh, Akum, the other half of the, uh, Authors of Pain. Um, so, I have, with this guy, oh, empty box. With this guy, you good, bro? With this guy, I have all of the figures I ordered. So, this whole box is a mystery. Don't know what's in it. Um, maybe it's something my mom ordered and it's gonna look real weird here on the live stream. But, uh, yeah. So, here we have Akum. He, he looks way meaner, meaner than, uh, Razor. But, yeah. Pretty, I think he has, like, the exact same body, just a different, like, his torso is painted on. Um, one thing I'd like to look at, though, I wonder if they gave him his own unique Samoan tat, or if they just threw on a Samoan tattoo from, uh, like, Uso or Roman Reigns. I wonder if they just, like, copy and pasted a Samoan tat onto him, or if they actually went through and, like, designed him his own Samoan tattoo. That would be really cool. Like, Tribal Tad, I guess, is what they should be called. Um, but I believe from, like, everything else, the figure's the exact same. Can't wait to animate with these figures. Um, it does look like he has a painted-on elbow pad from here, which is unique. Um, first figure to have painted-on elbow pad. But I'm hoping that they don't have the same issue that I have with, like, my Bam Bam Bigelow figure, where he's just, his torso is so big, I'm unable to animate with him. Uh, similar case with Braun Strowman. These guys are looking to be that way, but hopefully, hopefully we're not, not going to have that issue, you know. Drop that guy down there. Um, so here we have the big box. I have to be careful with this box because, oh, it's heavy too. Whatever's in there just shifted down. I did not like that. That was heavy. Uh, because this is the only box that I get, didn't get to taping because I, uh, I accidentally showed my address on an earlier live stream because I thought that I'd be okay not taping the box. But with my hurt finger... Um, I, uh, I can't really move the boxes around as well as I should be. So, cut this open gently. So I don't know what's on the other side of this box. Um, usually, 
I have cut the, the front part of figures boxes before, uh, like the packaging, which I'm not a mock collector usually, so that doesn't really bother me all that much. But this is being uncuttable for some reason. Maybe it just needs torn. Maybe that's what it wants. Maybe it wants ripped. And who doesn't want some extra watch time here on the channel? Hopefully whatever's in here doesn't spill out. Because I don't know what's in here, genuinely. You know what? I'm going to leave it standing up. So if something does fall out, you guys will get to see it as I do. Uh, but I... Tr oh, crap. I shouldn't have done that. Done messed this up. That's not good. Um, well, we'll leave it how it is. I'm not worried about it. So there's not much in here. What is this? Oh, that's right. I forgot I ordered this. <laughs> Well, that big box was very unenthusiastic, um, very, like, un ing because there was not that much in there. So I don't know why Amazon went to the the extremes of that big box. But uh, here we have a lamp I got. Um, I'm probably going to put it on the table, like, right over here so it can shine onto the unboxings. And it can also be moved to shine onto uh, the ring here or anywhere I'm kind of, like, uh animating or doing anything here uh i can have it shown and not shown but like providing light um just to kind of upgrade the quality a little bit because i hate the shadows that are made in the ring especially um i don't know if you guys can see but there is a shadow behind the referee right now at the moment and i just hate that and since this isn't really figure related I, I probably won't do a video on this thing so why don't i just throw it here on the stream um it doesn't want to be any, any uh, tape on it. I don't know anything about this brand, so if you guys know anything about Teotronix, it sounds Korean, especially by the letters. I don't want to be mistaken on my races, but uh, I don't really know what or even how to identify where it's from. So yeah, let's open it up. Hello. Pre 18th month warranty. Well, it's been in my house for probably a month already. Um, so we have some type of manual. I don't really need to know how to use a manual for a lamp. I don't know how lamps work. Um, I guess you guys are gonna get to see me put this together. Here, you guys want to scan this? Get a, get a free, uh, free gifts. I'm not subscribing to you guys. Screw you. Um, cool. A big, a big wipe to wipe it. Uh, so oh, screws in an hour inch. Oh great. Looks like I'm gonna have to put this thing together. So you guys are gonna get to see me struggle to build things on. On the live stream, ain't nothing like some uh, failed building to spice up your Saturday evening. And hey, thank you guys who were watching this after the fact of the live stream. Um, so, yeah. Empty little box. Dude, I'm gonna have so much cardboard to clean up at the end of this. It does come with a charger, uh, some type of outlet connector. I thought that I went for the uh, wireless version. Considering it's just gonna sit on the table, but guess not. Guess uh, guess this is what I got. So I don't know what is in here. I honestly don't know what's happening right now, guys. I'm just opening whatever's in front of me. This looks like it could be the arms. I'd assume. Oh, that that's the light. That is the light. That is about as light as it gets. <laughs> Mobby. I don't wanna break it yet. Uh oh, I want you guys to watch it in case it breaks. Yeah, I'm not going to force that in case it does break. Um, don't really know how this is supposed to work. have no idea. Probably should have read a manual. A manual? Oh, that's cool. So it's probably going to sit in like this. So sit straight down, and then this turns to put light wherever I want the light to go. By the looks of it, that's how it's going to work. And I can, like, angle it up to put light wherever I feel. Um... That is very, very cool. like that a lot already. I don't even have it, all. Don't even have it all the way unboxed. Oh, what's this thing? It's a big old pad. Big old pad is what that is. Well, there's some type of like, uh, like USB out port there. Um, oh, so it runs on a battery. So you plug it in, charge it, then it runs on a battery. Okay. I can dig that. This is the cord that came with it. Definitely does not go in there. Um, see, I don't really know where this is going to go. <laughs> uh, oh, it's going to go there. It's going to go right in there. 
Cool. Uh, there has to be something more to this. But uh, without looking at the instructions, so you guys are going to see if I mess something up. Here we have this part is going to go into this part. Hey, huzzah. Hey, how's that, guys? Look at that. Who needs some silly manual? We just do what we want. If it breaks, it breaks. Not my problem. Actually, it's my problem. But that's it. That's all that's in there. Does that have any power? So can I turn it on yet? All right, I don't know how this thing works. <laughs> I'm going to be directly honest with you guys right now. Jeez, I have too many boxes. So I don't know what this screw is for. It probably goes in the bottom. Let me read the manual real quick. See where this screw goes. Um, I'm betting it's going to go in this bottom down here. Because of how wobbly... Yeah, that's definitely where it goes. That thing's threaded. Yeah, I've been where that thing's going to go. Alright, who needs a manual? Again, I say. Um, I don't know how to do this. <laughs> well, obviously I know how a screw works. But I don't know how to hold it while I put the screw in. Whatever, dude. I don't know just suck to get out of bags. I don't want anyone to ever do that crap to me. So I don't know how to hold it to get it in there. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do, boys. We're using the bottom of the table. You guys want to see what I'm doing? <laughs> Bring guys right down here. Let me find it. There it is. Stick it in the hole. Whoa, whoa. Imagine I drop it and break it already. Then that would be hilarious for everyone but me. Yeah, I don't know how this thing's going. I wish I could see on camera how it was going. Ow. So how's your guys' day going? How's your week? It's your past three weeks since I saw something I uploaded. Um, again, my, my finger hurt. Um, right as I was like, you know, I want to get back into doing YouTube. Done hurt my finger. But I should have plenty of projects to be doing now with all these reviews and unboxings. Or not unboxings anymore. There's no more unboxings. Um, with all these reviews. We're getting there, boys. We are getting there. Is it, will it turn on yet, or do I still need to charge it? All right, um, eventually, I'll make some type of Instagram post showing you guys this thing in action. Uh, I guess they sent it to me dead. Most things I've ever received have been charged when I've gotten them out of the box. But, you know, it's all good. You green people. Oop, tripod is messing up. So, yeah. Well, guys, I'm going to keep screwing this in. And eventually, it'll get tighter. Don't really know how to fill the space. Kind of want to just end it because how awkward I am being. Yeah, well, that, is, that thing's turning on. When I learn how to use this thing, I will tell you guys. And uh, so with that said, I uh, do thank you all so very much for watching. going to try and show you guys the mess without showing you guys, like, my full room because um, it is also a mess. There's the figures we got. And here's all the boxes. You know my clothes. There's all the boxes. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it. There's the lamp we got. And uh, so with that said, hopefully you all did enjoy. I do thank you all so very much for watching. I'll see you next time.